Hello friends, today I have another video of science and that is our earth. So let's begin. So first let's look let's look at the content. And and they are land. In land we have different categories like plains, forests, deserts, coast, polar region, hills, mountains, valleys and water. So let's begin the chart. First, let's have a quick reference about what our earth is. Our earth is made up of land and water. In some places, the earth is flat and plain. In other places, it is raised. In most of the places, there is water. All around the earth is air. Now, let's begin the chapter with land. Now, what is land? Our earth has different types of land. It has plains, forests, desert, hills, mountains and valleys. So guys, can you guess the type of land by looking at this picture? As I already mentioned before. Yes, you are correct. It's plains. Now what are plains? Plains are vast areas of flat land. Many different kinds of crops can grow here. Many people also live here. Depending on the season, it is either hot or cold in the plains. So, one thing I would love to tell about this is, most cities, towns and villages are built in the plains. So, uh, let's move further. Now, can you guess the next type of land by looking at this picture yes you are correct i know it is easy forest now what are forests in some places large parts of land have different types of trees growing close to one another these are called forests a large number of wild animals live in forests Now, can you guess the next type of land by looking at this picture? Yes, it is easy again, I know. Deserts. Now, what are deserts? The land in some parts of the earth is very, very dry. It is covered with sand. Such a place is called a desert. Deserts have very little rain and water. Only a few plants can grow here. A few animals like camel are found here. One thing over here I would love to tell that very few people uh, live in desert because the weather over here is very hot and some people cannot uh, bear this kind of weather. Now can you guess the next type of land by looking at this picture? Yes, you are correct. It was quite difficult but you passed. It is coast. Now what are coasts? The land. The land areas near the seas, sea are called coasts. There are sandy beaches near coasts. Many people live in coastal areas. Coconut trees grow well in coastal areas. Now, one thing over here I would love to tell is, coastal areas are warm and the air is wet. It makes people sweat a lot. Now, can you guess? This type of land? Yes. It was quite hard but a little easy too because of the snow all around and the igloo and the penguins. We find them just one way. And that is polar regions. Yes. In, now what are polar regions? In polar regions, the land is always covered with Lots of snow and ice. Very few plants grow in these areas. A few animals like polar bears and seals can survive here. Because of the cold weather, people living live in houses made up of ice slabs called igloos. People living in polar regions are called Eskimos. Now, the next land, yes, you correct, as it is 
is shorter than mountain they are hills and what are they a hill is a place which is higher than the surrounding land hilly areas are generally cool and pleasant it rains very often in the hills uh, one thing over here i would like to tell and this is very important also so because of this the houses on the hills have sloping roofs to let the rain fall rain water fall away easily okay so now as i told you before hills the next stage is mountains yes now what are mountains mountains are much higher than hills some mountains are rocky some are full of forest and animals some are very high mountains covered with snow can you guess one mountain for me which is very 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 high yes mount everest and one thing over here is very important that when snow melts when snow melts water starts flowing down the the mountain in this way a river a river is formed okay if anyone asks asks you how is a river formed then you uh, then now you are able to answer that and the last type of land by looking at this yes valleys now what are valleys a long area of low land that lies between mountains or hills is called a valley valleys are good for farming okay so one thing over here is valleys are good for farming now next thing is after looking at this so much water around that must be water only is that true yes so now what now uh, basically water this part of water is divided into two slides so first we will uh, look at this one and then we begin uh, further so over here what is water a large part of the earth surface is filled with water water is very important to us all living things need water that is very 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 obvious you may also die if you don't get water for uh, many days so this is the second part of water most of the water present on the earth is salt water it is present in vast water bodies called oceans and seas as all of us know oceans and seas are too big and they contain salty water we cannot drink salty water so fresh water we can use is present in rivers lakes streams and ponds so even though uh, the water in rivers lakes streams and ponds uh, we uh, which we can use and are fresh we need to purify it because tiny germs are still there in that water a lot of water is also stored as ice and snow thank you all for watching bye i will i will meet in my next